Yo, ATM, thank you so much for that. Definitely appreciate that, dude. Are you able to change this, uh, the title too, or do I need to do that? If not, that's totally fine. Again, that's just greatly helpful. I appreciate that. Yeah, this actually looks great. Let's go. Like, look at this. GBA in all of its glory. 2004, 2005, let's get it. But yeah, see, like, I made some progress as it is. Minish Cap, but we ain't capping. I can dig it. Let's go. Um, I guess we're going to take it. Let's go with uh, Metallic. Why not? Let's go with Metallic. And I can actually play with the D-pad again. It actually kind of feels nice. Let's go. Yo, ATM, thank you for that. Definitely appreciate it. Uh, we're going with Metal. Let's go with it. Metal's fine. All right, let's go. We'll do, like, we'll do a good amount of... We should be able to get, like, you know, pretty good progress here. So let's go with it. Ooh, we get story. Let's do it. A long, long time ago... <laughs> this looks brutal. When the world was on the verge of being swallowed by shadow. Same setup I normally do my games, but Joe, so good, so good. You gotta love it, right? The tiny Picori appeared from the sky, bringing the hero of a man with a sword and golden light. With wisdom and courage, the hero drove out the darkness. I mean, sometimes I'm kind of serious about it. Like, let's be real. Sometimes I'm actually serious about my titles. Like, when I was playing Hades, I was thinking, like, you know, trying to escape hell with daddy issues, but that I'm like, nah, it's a little bit too much. When peace have been restored and the people enshrined the blade with care. I'm assuming it's called, like, the Picori blade or something like that. Either way, I'm, I'm hyped for it. Let's do it. And it's, again, in my favorite, like, incantation of the Link, like, with the, uh, the Wind Waker, like, with, you know, like, no Zelda and stuff like that, so I'm pretty hyped for it. I'm so excited this is happening. Yo, same, dude. Same. Again, never... I didn't and not enjoy it. So, like, I just got distracted with something else. Good morning, Master Smith. Goodness me, Princess Zelda. Did you sneak out of the castle and come all this way alone? That minister is sure to be worried about you. You know how he gets. You only played the first few minutes before? No, like, I think, um, again, like, on my, you know, other playthrough, I had, like a few of the different items you get in some more hearts. So I like, I think I did like the first two dungeons. Oh, you're worried about him. He'll be fine. Where's metal? The whole town is bustling for the annual Picori festival. And I thought he and I might go together. Would you mind terribly? Oh, is that the way you're going for here? Well, metal's been up late. He up me last night. He's still asleep. But I do have an errand at the castle. Yes, that should be fine. Metal, time to get up. Yeah, we're still sleeping, dude. Metal, time to get up! Stupid kid. Pixel art is on point, let's go. Yo, I can roll? Wait, we actually still have a, we actually still have a restore point. That's pretty impressive. I love it, all right, let's go. So good, all right, we're done rolling. They see me rolling. All right, let's jump into it. Or roll into it, I should say. <laughs> hey, Metal! Princess Zelda's here, and she'd like to know if you'd join her at the festival. Yeah, Metal, come on. Let's go check it out. The festival together. Master Smith already gave me the permission to take you. Yes, after all, the festival only comes around once a year. Go on, have some fun. While you're there, you can do me a favor. Do me a solid. I just finished making the sword for the minister at the Hyrule Castle. I'd like you to deliver it to him. Yo, yeah, what's up? We can do it. <laughs> it's so good. You accepted the Smith Sword. Make sure you don't lose this extremely important delivery. I said it's the blade that will be presented to the winner of the competition. Competition, fa! Don't lose it. While the two of you may be childhood friends, remember, tell this the prince to fire rule. You watch over her. Don't let her do anything bad happen to her. Master Smith, quit worrying. We'll be perfectly safe. Come on, Metal. Let's go check out the festival. Stupid kids. Off at the races. Zelda's a princess of fire roll. You watch over. Don't let anything bad happen to her. I got you. I got you, Gramps. I got you. <laughs> you can tell this is a GBA game for sure. Metal, over here. I can't even equip the sword. That kind of sucks. I mean, it's a, it's a delivery, and that's fine. That's fine. It's fine. Metal, hurry, let's go. 
Over here, come on, hurry up. This is such a different incantation from Zelda. It's insane. Well, here we are, the town of Hyrule. We just had to live on the air skirts. Here we are, Metal. Doesn't it look fun? Come on, let's look around. Sure, why not? I'm just I just woke out of bed, but what do you expect me to do anything else? Uh, what do we gotta look around? So where oh here's Zelda. Metal, there's a storyteller here. We should stop and listen to Oh, I wonder what's over there. Oh, she has like no attention span. I can I can vibe with that. So the Picori are real. My father always told me they were. Oh look at that. So yeah, there wasn't gonna be a sword fighting tournament at the castle. I wonder who won this year. Oh wow, over here? We have a winner! Oh my, Princess Zelda, you've won the grand prize in the drawing. Wow! You get any one of your choices of these wonderful prizes. What will it be? First, we have this lovely heart-shaped stone. Next, we have, ooh, this magnificent gem. And finally, there's a shield. This teeny tiny shield. So which one would you like? Let me guess, the jewel? Mm -hmm, but what about this heart? It's very cute too. Choose whichever one you would like. This shield is so adorable, I think I'll take it. Nani? Why would you want such an ugly thing? What about the Hearthstone? It's cute. Or, or this giant gem, it's simply pretty. Honestly, I don't know there's much nicer than that nasty little shield thing. Nope, I want the shield. Can I have it? What a strange princess you are. Well, here's your teeny tiny shield. Here, I want to give this to you as a present. Doesn't the shield suit you perfectly, Metal? Yo, she likes us. She likes us. Princess Zelda gave you the small shield. Hold the button to protect yourself. It is a little embarrassing though, it is so tiny. I mean, it still works, it gets a job done, it gets a job done. Yep, just as I thought, you look great. Now if anything happens, you protect me with that shield. Oh, I almost forgot, we have to take the Master Sword, the Master Smith Sword to the castle. Let's go, Metal. All right, let's keep, let's keep barrel rolling, let's go. This is not gonna get annoying at all, is it? Oh, come on, Metal, let's hurry and look to the castle. Oh, we actually had, we had the fight him, we just had like, you know, blocks. Oh, <laughs> Ouch! That must be the uh, the business job I heard the soldiers talking about. They were saying a Deku scrub has uh, been out seeing the passerby. But I'll do something about it, otherwise we can't get to the castle. If only we had some way to defeat ourselves against those nuts of his. Yo, what? Uh, so the button is A? That doesn't feel right. Actually, no, that's fine, that's fine. There we go, we game in. Please forgive me, sir. I've heard there was a festival and I was coming to town hoping to hawk my wares. Unfortunately, we scrubs have a tendency to spit nuts when we speak. Everyone got scared and ran away and no one would buy anything. And this is a terrible place to do business. I'm going back to my cave. There we go. I actually feel sorry for that business scrub, but that nut hurt. Oh, well, uh, he won't be harassing us anymore now, so better hurry to the castle. That's not gonna get annoying at all, is it? Yo, what's up, guys? I got a sword here to deliver. Yeah, yeah Metal, you brought the master, the sword, did you? But as a master of the kingdom of Hyrule, I, Potho, accept this blade. You came just in time. Your what ceremony will begin soon. I'm sorry, Metal, but I better go. I have to prepare for the ceremony. I had a good time at the festival, though. Uh, thanks for coming with me. Since you're here, Metal, why don't you join us for the award ceremony? I would love to, to further drive the plot. Is that the Picori Blade? Do you know about that sword metal? It is called the Picori Blade, and it looks, locks away much evil in that chest. The Picori Blade is sacred among the people of Hyrule. The legend has it, long ago, the Picori gave us that blade. Whoever wins a competition earns the honor of touching the sacred blade. Yo, it's my boat! He's back! Aw, it's been forever, boat. How's it hanging? How's, how's the underwater light treating you, my dude? Let the award ceremony commence. Vati, champion of the competition. You may approach the blade. Yo, Vati's in this game? Or is it a different incantation of Vati? Because, like, wasn't Vati also in Force Wars Adventure? I'm not complaining. I'm vibing. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> to think things would go this well. The Picori Blade and the bound chest spoken to the Hyrulean lore. The chest must hold what I seek. I relieve you of its contents now.
He's just like animating it. <laughs> Do not interfere with me. As the victor, I have earned the right to approach the Bikori Blade. I've been waiting for this moment. Yo, that's that's copyrighted coming at me, huh, bro? Are you sure gonna be watching that off? Oh, he just broke the blade. Holy crap, this is insane. And he opened up Pandora's box at this point. Hello, Metal. How's everyone? How are y'all tonight? Yo, Savannah, welcome to the stream. Great to see you. Hope you are doing well. I'm doing pretty good. I appreciate you for asking. We just finished Wind Waker, so we're starting off the next Zelda game. As a part of Retro Friday being the Legend of Zelda Minish Cap. How are you doing today? Who are you and why are you doing this? Yo, Hopes, yes. Welcome to the stream as well. Good to see you as well. Hope you are feeling okay today. The princess with the mystic aura. The power that was gifted to the people of Hyrule still flows within the veins of the ladies of its royal family. Interesting. If I leave you now, you will only cause me trouble later. That will never do. To stone with you! Oof. So we gotta like, so our journey and try to like take care of her? <laughs> All who stand in my way shall share this fate. Now to find the power that awaits me in this chest. Not at all, the f garage flood and all my furniture and books and miscellaneous things are now destroyed. Wow, I'm, Jesus, I'm sorry to hear, how did it, how did it flood? Like, did a pipe burst or something or what happened? Is everybody okay? Empty, there's nothing in here but a rabble of monsters. What is the meaning of this? Well, I know the force that I'm after. It's something out there. I'm in no hurry. I can take my time searching for it. <laughs> It's been raining nonstop. It's like three inches of rain. That is insane. Like, it's weird that the weather is so polar opposite. It's like, for us, it's like 110 degrees now. We hope so. I'm sorry. Is there any way of being able to salvage it? I'm on the brink of self-destructing. I'm so, I'm so sorry to hear that, Hope CS. Um, Let me know if there's anything I can do. I'm, I'm sorry to hear that. Is, is Zach able to do anything? Oh, thank goodness. You're awakened. Master Smith is here as well. He just come to his majesty to the king. That is crazy. I didn't even know that was actually raining that much. That is insane. I'm doing good. I just found out there there are adult beverages in the fridge. There you go. Especially like a mini fridge. I feel like that's kind of a common, but that's awesome. Oh, Metal, you're awake. Are you feeling all right? Stand at my side. The king of Hyrule is about to speak. I tried to do what I could, but I lost so much. I just thankfully Steven's baby book and the things are fine. That is true. Because like with the baby book, it just houses so many memories, but... Definitely, definitely let message me later after stream if there's anything I can do to help. Um, that is awful. I'm sorry to hear that. I hope he is. I didn't even know it was actually raining that bad. Like, because I feel like it was like everywhere else, like where it's just like a bad heat wave. It is all as you have heard. A sorcerer named Valti has cursed my fair Zelda and turned her to stone. If we had the sacred Vicori blade, we might likely have broken the curse. But Valti shattered the blade. However, I've not given up hope. What do you know about the Vicori? The Picori? Not much. Believe the fairy tales were easy, though I suppose we had to be very tiny. I'm not sure if I remember correctly. Yes, the ones from the fairy tales, but the Picori are no mere legend. They most certainly exist. No one outside the royal family knows the truth about them. The Picori who have forged the sacred blade live deep within the Minish woods. They should be able to repair the broken blade to reforge the sword. What? Then we must dispatch the soldiers at once. No soldiers will not do. The Bikori do not show themselves to anyone but children. Our soldiers could search them for days and still find no sign. Same. I, I would definitely would want to give you a hug as well, Hopes. Yes, that's definitely not good. I'm so sorry to hear that happen to you. Like, because honestly, like, again, that's just so much stuff that could be just, like, just lost. I'm sorry, Hopes. Yes. I see. So if that were the case, then why not send Metal? If Metal is recovered, then yes. I would like to ask this of him. Please, turn my Zelda back into normal. The Bikori should know how to create a new sacred sword. It will be a dangerous journey if now that those monsters have been freed. Please, take this sword with you, along with the broken Bikori blade. You have accepted the broken Bikori blade. This is a part of the sword needed to reforge the sacred sword. Do not lose it. And we also got a, not a broken sword. Let's go. You got the smith sword. It's a sharp blade made by your grandfather. Very well. Then send the soldiers to search for Vati at once. He will not leave this place alive. Deep within the Minish Woods, you will find a place called Deepwood Shrine. Once, humans and Picori shored that shrine as a meeting place. I think it would be best if you started searching there. 
The worst part is the furniture we had came from Steven's dad, our dad and grandma, and one from mom too. I'm trying to save the tail from grandma at least. For sure. Um, I mean, if you can get in a way or just like out of the garage and like have it like dry off, it, it could definitely see about being salvageable too. Like for sure. Especially if it's like, you know, made out of wood, like it shouldn't be too bad. Um, as long as like it's dried pretty quickly. Take this map with you. If you get lost in your way to the forest, simply check your map. Press start, then L or R to open the map. I marked the location of the forest for you. Good luck and be careful, you little scout. You have the map of Hyrule. Now you'll never get lost. Look at that high res map. Let's go. All right. I'm counting on you, Metal. Only you can break Vati's curse, free Princess Zelda, and prevent wildfires. Yeah, that's a uh, that's that's a uh, kind of a lot of thing we have on our plate. Uh, sounds good. I will not let you down. The entire area is flooded, so it has to stay in the garage. But I sacrifice a fifty-dollar water table to prop up Grandma's and hopes it'll be okay. I mean, honestly, probably the best use of a Walmart table I've ever seen because those. Those definitely, you know, are not able to, but hopefully it does protect it for sure. Um, is it staying out of the water at least? Because honestly, if it's staying out of the water, that's definitely going to be very beneficial for it. Oh, Octoroks, let's go. Oh, there's a crow too. Yeah, we moved everything at least a foot or so. Okay, so that's pretty good. Is it still storming too? Or is it kind of stopped now at this point? So they said start. We can save really quick. Might as well do that. Yeah, let's save really quick. It is and it's continued though tomorrow. Okay, hopefully though, it's um, hopefully like the ferocity from the snow, like rain is gone away though by then. So an army of shock vacs is back in the water. Yes, we need to deploy all the shock vacs to the garage to make sure it doesn't happen anymore. Cause honestly that, that just sucks. Uh, again, I'm really sorry, Hope, because I would, if only I can give you the heat wave that we're happening right now and help evaporate the water. These guys are such classics. The name is Walter, I'm the head carpenter around these parts. The King of Hyrule himself has entrusted me with this project. Oh, I think the sorcerer attacked toward some pretty bad things around here. You know, kid, you should be playing thing near the construction zone. Oh, come on, dude. What do we gotta do? So busy, gotta finish here that I can go repair the steps next. I wish I had ice cream right now. I wish I could send you some ice cream, honestly. That'd be, if I could do that, that'd be awesome. Um, but I mean, like right now, it's like almost two. I don't even know if there's any place that'd be open here for that. So the Victoria Blade was just a lock keeping those monsters in that chest. The rumor is that Vati was looking for something inside the chest. I know, I mean, something other than monsters, but nobody knows for sure what it is. I'll tell you, it has been nothing but a big headache to the rest of us. I mean, I don't blame you, dude. Uh, we gotta figure out like where to go from here. Um. You got a heart. These replenish your eye of energy when it's low. I mean, if I could, I I mean, I don't like I could try to see if Amazon has any ice cream. I could try to do like Amazon Prime through to you, um, but hopefully they can keep it frozen. I don't, I don't know if Amazon actually delivers ice cream. Like if that's actually a case, though, then you can definitely bet your butt that we're going to send you some ice cream. Uh, oh, I can just jump down there. That's good. That's now we're gaming. Why wait for the bridge when I can just jump over a ledge? <laughs> oh no, never mind, never mind. Um, okay. Let's see. Ooh, this looks promising. There we go, now we're gaming. Lon Lon Ranch? Hell yeah, let's go. The fact that it has like these nostalgic locations, I love it. Love you too, Hopsy is. Love you too. Octorok's gonna be defeated. Easily, easily. Oh, we gotta go with the money. We got, we gotta get the monies. So it's like a ship merc. I'm pretty sure they could ship ice cream. That's actually a very good point. My only concern though is I don't know if Amazon trucks can actually like keep things at a cool temperature. Um, that's that's like my big thing, you know. Because so I think like with milk you can kind of get away with it for a little bit, but like with ice cream it can melt pretty soon. Hyrule Castle, Hyrule Town, Minish Woods. We are on the right way. Cause like if I do send out like you know ice cream to Amazon, um, and it gets to hopes yes, it can go from ice cream to a milkshake really fast. But you know sometimes milkshakes are actually pretty good. Like especially mint chocolate chip uh, milkshakes, those are good. Those are actually pretty pog. Seeing Link without a hat though is actually kind of disorienting. Can't wait to actually get the minish cap really quick. Can't open that, that's fine. 
So they did say we have to go to the Minish Cap and see if we can find the Picori. Um, so maybe we can find something pretty soon. I mean, think of it, Hopesius. Yes. Uh, milkshake, uh, you don't have to have any utensils. It goes down smooth. It's not going to give you brain freeze, most likely. Honestly, I I'm thinking a milkshake might be a game changer right now. <laughs> um, but for real, like, I think actually after the stream, I'm probably going to like literally look up, does Amazon ship out ice cream? And if so, let's get some good flavors, too. Well, good utensils die, too, with the flood. I mean, I feel like you should... Uh, are they, like... Are they just like covered in water? Help, help me! Yo, we got a Picori? Oh, it's the hat, let's go. Ouch, won't somebody stop them? Hey, help, somebody, can somebody hear me? Well, the gross water at this point is, oh, that, that's fair. I forgot that it was like part of the, the garage and it cannot be the most sanitary place, but yo, a piece of heart is just chilling right here. Well, let's freaking go, that is amazing. All right, we gotta go find that hat that is crying out in the night. Um, I know I don't know where it is. Uh, we just gotta go around and try to find it. I can't travel here. Music is a bop. Yo, like again, like Zelda handheld games never disappoint you, Tim. They really never do. Oh, there we go. It's always Doctor Rocks. Hey, kid, you there? Hey, don't just stand there. Do something. What's wrong with you today? Watch me like this takes some kind of abuse. Help me. Yo, ATM, uh, ATM, actually, can you do me a favor? Can you see if Amazon does deliver ice creams? Um, I want to see if I can actually send out the ice cream. I hope he is. Phew, well done. That was close. Not that I could handle all that myself, but besides the point, um, <clears throat> what in the world is the lone child doing such deep in the woods? I see. So just a nightmare. No, I mean, I, I, I totally get it. Like, we had to go through the forest fires. Like, unfortunately, um, again, like, those natural disasters just make it really hard. I wish there was more I can do. Tons of it. Yo, let's go. Hope you guys let me know what type of flavor you want. We can go from there. Yo, Saiyan teacher, welcome to the stream. It's good to see you. Hope you are doing well, dude. Hope you are doing well. Is that so? I see. I know you have and I have a lot in common. I see, I too am on a quest to break a curse of Vati's. And you say that reforging the sacred blade can break his curse, huh? Well, then you found yourself a new companion, buddy. My name is Elzo. It's a pleasure to make your acquaintance. But Zane teacher, it's good to see you, dude. Hope you are doing well. How's it going, dude? What, is, is there something in my face? Quit staring, it's rude. Um, dude, just, just, just wondering, Metallic, is that the Minish Cap on the Wii U Virtual Console? You are correct, Saiyan Teacher. It is. It is. Good guess. Wait, wait, I say. You walk so quickly. Too quickly, in fact. Can't you go any slower? Surely you've noticed that I have no legs. Because, like, you see, Saiyan Teacher, everything that I do stream is either on the original hardware or some kind of, like, re-release form. Boy, I'll take a good look around. Do you know what really helps that I walk around fast? <laughs> He's so pissed. If it isn't one thing, it's another. You are a troublesome boy. There we go. Now we got the hat. Let's go. There. Now you can't possibly leave me behind. My, it, it, it's quite comfortable up here. More comfortable than it looks, surely. And much easier on me. Now quit your squirming. Can't you see still? Yes, there it is. Much better. Now, I suppose a boy like you still has much to learn about the world. If you ever need my insight, just press select. And I'll be happy to assist. Such a hopeless child. Bought myself a Wii U and it's coming tomorrow for the same reason. I never played DK64 and Metroid Fusion. Yo, same teacher, the Wii U honestly has one of the best virtual consoles out there. And honestly, some really good games. Like, you can get pretty cheap, which is awesome. So that is really awesome, dude. Like, the, the Wii U definitely deserves more praise than crap it gives for. Like, I know Nintendo didn't do a whole lot to support it, but it's still a great system, you know? Are you looking forward to the new Metroid uh, Dread coming out? Cause that's a new Metroid game that we're getting that kind of came out of nowhere, honestly. I agree with you, right? It's so good. Like again, it gave us Wind Waker HD. What more could, what more could I ask for? Uh, we gotta find like, uh, we gotta go back actually, I think. Cause there was a pathway we should be able to travel to. Yo, Savannah, thank you so much for the host. Greatly appreciate that. Hold on for a minute, boy. We are stumbled across something important. The world of the Minish is very small. You are far too big to meet them right now. Hmm? Who are the Minish? Ah, yes. Silly, allow me to explain. You humans call them Picori, but they refer to themselves as the Minish. 
Strange how in the world of humans only the forest has kept that name. Anyway, deep in the forest they built a tiny village, where many now live. But if you were to enter the village, you would have to make yourself a touch smaller first. Look at that, at first glance it appears to be a mere stump, huh? Yes? No, that stump is a portal we used to be our people long ago to adjust their size. With my help, you can shrink down to diminished size. Just stand on the stump, press R to shrink. To normal, stand on the stump and press R again. Get me up there and we'll give it a try. I'll play all the Metroid 2Ds before it comes out. Sounds like a great plan, honestly. Like, it's just a great way to get yourself super hyped for it. Just notice the health skip, I love it. Yo, I appreciate it. Like, My Hero Academia is just so good. I figured present Mike is, it's it's a great way to do it. Like, you know, because like, you know, mics and hosting and stuff like that. Welcome to the world through the eyes of the Minish. Now, aren't you glad you saved me? No need to thank me though. Portals that reduce your size and all around in different shapes and sizes. If you want to return to normal, stand next to the portal and press the R button. But there's one thing you must know. Being Minish size is full of dangers. Mere puddles at your size are bottomless swamps to the Minish. Hey Metal, how late about Yo Ashes? Welcome to the stream. It's great to see you. Uh, we're probably gonna play a little bit longer because we actually finished Wind Waker tonight. And I guess we're starting Minish Cap right now. Hope you're doing well. Another tech question, do you only use Elgato on the Wii U? Um, yeah, like right now I have everything that I stream to Twitch is running through the Elgato, unless like Duel Links or stuff like that. Um, with Steam, you could just use the game source, but yeah, everything I stream like, you know, for my consoles, it's through the Elgato because it looks pretty great. My friends actually compare my energy to present Mike, so I find that ironic and hilarious. It's so good. Like, I think I like present Mike a little bit more in the sub because I think when they first introduced present Mike, he's like, everybody say hey. And like the entire crowd is just like, what, what? So good. <laughs> and as your companion, if anything bad happens to you, it happens to me too. It's kind of obnoxious, but I, I guess that's just his character though, dude. So proceed with caution, my lad, and if not for your own sake, then for my own. I can't roll, wait, can we still roll? Okay, we can still roll. So that's pretty good. All right, we go through, that is so dope. Super interesting, I, I like how like, you know, like when you're in the form of like the Minish height, like the overall changes a little bit to like kind of like help you go through certain things. Ooh, this looks really nice too. Like this just shows you how small Link is now. Like again, acorns, pretty small, they're pretty small. Right? You gotta love the Minish Cap, it's super good. Hmm, it appears we have found the Minish Village. The Picori are also pretty adorable too. Like, the 8-bit, 16-bit, whatever. It doesn't do it justice, but like, actually look up the Minish Cap. Like, you know, the Picori, they're actually pretty adorable. Minish Cap is still getting you fun. It's been so long since I played it, right? I mean, I played it once before a while ago. But I never really, I never really did too much to it. Like I got kind of far, but I didn't like do enough. And I haven't played in forever, so I kind of forgot about it. But Lady Ellen, welcome to the stream. Great to see the story, the story of this one is pretty good. That's what I've been hearing. I've been hearing nothing great about Minish Cap and I enjoyed it when I did play it. But the fact that like, you know, we just finished Wind Waker. I'm like, you know, this is kind of like a nice, great segue into it, you know? Pico, Pico, Repo, Kiko. I can't say that. I gather it's been quite some time since I've last seen a human. What's that? You don't understand what they were saying just now? Ah, yes, that is the language of the Minish. It's a little different from the dialect I'm most familiar with, but I'm afraid I didn't catch most of what they said myself. But perhaps who those who are here will understand your language. We should look around. It's about seven years since I, since I played it. I mean, it seems like it's, uh, it came out in like 2004 or five, I think, right? Like, I believe that was like the time frame. Nope, I'm pretty sure we had to like find like the Elder or something like that. Something like that. But now like for real, welcome to the stream lady. I hope you're doing well. How goes it? Yeah, saying teacher. Hope's yes is actually my actual sister, like Bible blood and everything. Oh, this, this looks kind of important. Let's check it out. Hmm, I've never seen an outfit like that before. Are you a human? Oh 
Goodbye, it's been quite some time since any humans came here. My name is Fessery. I watch the Abbey and as well as the Shrine to the North. You seem to be having some trouble with our language, don't you? You could always use a Jabba nut. It'll allow you to understand our tongue. You should be able to find one in one of the barrel houses just south of here. He's cute himself. No, 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 not at all. Not at all. We gotta go with Zack. I think Zack got the looks out of all this, and I just kind of like got the sloppy seconds. <laughs> oh, they said barrel to the south. Um, I mean, this is kind of a barrel. I guess this is kind of a barrel. Oh, oh wait, that actually is it. We just did the puzzle wrong because I'm bad. No <laughs> one's. All right, let's do it. Let's try this again. There we go. There we go. Give me the Jabbernut. Oh, Metal! That must be the Jabbernut the story you told you about. Well, you better eat if you plan on getting all the progress at all. You ate the Jabbernut. Now you can understand the language of the Minish. Remember playing that when I was younger? I, I think it was 2004. Um, let me, uh, let me double check really quick. Let me double check. Let me double check. Yeah, November 4th, 2004, and it was... Yo, plot twist. This, the producer for this game was Kiji, uh, Kiji Afune, which is the pretty much like the dude who made Mega Man what it is today. Kiji Afune actually had a hand in this game? That is really insane. I did not realize that, honestly. Never would have guessed you and Hope were siblings, but oh my god, does it make sense now? <laughs> the first Pathions in the Nightmare Grove took me the whole day. Yo, those, like, the Hollow Knight is such a great game, Saiyan Teacher, but it's also pretty difficult for sure. I Googled it. Yeah, like, I had to Google it too as well to double check it. But, like, I'm just still kind of surprised it's Kiji Afune behind it. Oh, you speak our language. It's been quite a while since we've heard the outsiders speak our tongue. Yeah, they also did uh, Oracle of Ages and Seasons, which are some of my favorite Zelda games of all time. We have little to offer you in these days, Woods, but please enjoy your stay. Thank you for the offer, but we have no time to relax. My name is Edslow. This child is metal. We need to break a curse that has been cast on the Princess of Hyrule. To do so, we need to reforge the broken Picori blade. Ah, yes. And how we come here hoping to have the blade forge? Hmm. Well, it seems like you're after you'll need four mystic elements. These elements are in the crystalline forms of energies of this world. Only by infusing the blade with these energies can be a new blade formed again. Here, give me your map. I can mark where these elements can be found. Never played those. Never got to play those. They're really good. Um, they were re-released for the Nintendo uh, 3DS eShop. If you have an eShop, it's definitely a good pickup. I think it's like eight bucks per title. Um, but also you can like you know find them online pretty easily. Got to play through most of the Zelda games. So right on. What is your favorite one? If you don't mind me asking. Capcom definitely needs to make more Zelda games. I totally agree. Like they did a great job with this one of the Oracle games. I would support that wholeheartedly. The Earth Element can be found in the Shrine to the north of Festory's Abbey. Speak with Festory, he will show you the path to the Shrine's entrance. Go with caution. <laughs> ATM, thank you for that. Appreciate you, my dude. Go with caution. Evil creatures have lately made their home in our Shrine. Return to me at once after you found the Earth Element. It seems like the pacing for this game is actually pretty quick. Not gonna lie. Um, it just seems like it. Otherwise, we're just kind of like speeding through it. Too many good ones, honestly, for real. We just, uh, about an hour ago, we actually just finished Wind Waker HD, one of my favorite games of all time, period. You wish to go to the shrine, very well, this way. Breath of the Wild, Breath of the Wild is such a great one. So good, so good. Vile beasts have secu uh, settled in recently. Be careful, it's quite dangerous. How dangerous, though? Oh, wait, no, we don't go back in there yet. Uh, let's, let's check out in here first. Uh, I don't... Yeah, we can't cross that because we'll probably drown. This is where we got that piece of heart. What is this, actually? Wind Waker is so good. It's chill. It's very easy to get through, honestly. Um, but it's still a really good experience. Um, it's probably going to be a game I keep going back to, you know, really quite often. Oh, wow. Huh. We already got there pretty quick. So this would be the Deepwood Shrine the Minish Elder spoke of. He said something about there being monsters inside, did he? Hey, no, nobody needs to be afraid or anything. Uh, we'll be waiting right here. Uh, no, wait, what, what? What am I saying? I'm not letting you leave me out here alone. Then chill with us, man. Let's uh, let's do... Yeah, we could probably do the first uh, dungeon and it'd be good. Excited to get Skyward Switch and the sword. Yo, that... Like, I'm actually kind of surprised they went with Skyward Sword of all things. 
Um, I mean, I'm not complaining, but it's not what I was expecting. I was kind of hoping for, like, maybe Oracle remakes. remakes, But I guess we just weren't meant to be at this point, you know? But it's all good. I haven't played all the way through Skyward Sword, so if it just runs really good on the Switch, uh, I might be tempted to pick it up. Have you played Skyward Sword at all? Ooh, we got our first key. Hmm, there's a locked key here. See if you don't have a key to open it. I have a key. We are good. We have a key. Oh, slow. Chill. We have a key. Ooh, slugs. Not fun. Uh, we need an item here, right? Do you see that lever? I think you should be able to pull it. Just stand in front and press R to grab it, and then press the D-pad. Finished it. Nice. I've heard it was a really good title. I've heard a lot of people didn't like it, though, for some reason, but I've heard it was actually really good. I won't spoil the story. No, it's all good. I appreciate it, though. Um. Let's see, so do we... Oh, okay, so we don't let go. We just hold on to it, but just stop. Got it. Okay, cool. There we go. Oh, cool. Looks like we don't have to worry about getting, like, a power bracelet. It just already is an ability. Honestly, like, I do have Skyward Sword for the Wii, but I think for some reason I kind of just, like, stopped playing it. But it wasn't a bad title by any means, you know? I, uh, I'll probably see about picking up the Switch copy maybe at some point. Wow, look at the size of that barrel. Right, <laughs> sounds silly to me. It's not big, we're just small. That's how it goes. Big picture wise of those other years. Yeah, like it pretty much sets everything in motion because um, like how they kind of like, you know, how like, why, it kind of like breaks down why Zelda and, you know, Ganon and stuff like that keeps happening. Um, I remember that much reading in the Hyrule Historia because I actually did pick up the Hyrule Historia. Because, why not, you know? It's it's Zelda, and I love Zelda. I'm gonna pick up the Hyrule History and, like, all those other books and stuff. Oh, kinda messed that. Oh, cool, never mind, we didn't mess it up. We're, we're okay, we're okay, actually. So we're gonna go down. We're gonna do this. Oh. Okay, yeah, we actually have to go back. That kinda sucks. That's okay, though. Hope you broke it's all the love. Indeed, indeed. Hopefully, uh, hopefully, um, all the other ones are also, you know, dealing, are doing okay right now, too. Oh, by the way, uh, Shin Megami Nocturne sales across all regions have reached 400k. That is actually pretty cool. Like, because I feel like Shin Megami Tensei and, like, you know, those games don't really get a lot of attention as it is. So that's actually pretty cool to hear that's actually selling pretty well. And, uh, hopefully it convinces Atlas to remaster Persona 3 or maybe give us a remake? What? Hey, be careful, my lad. The barrel just moved. Did it now. So cool. So cool. I love that. Um, we gotta open it back up right here, I believe. Okay, cool, cool. We're on the right way. Uh so that's a door I can't open right now. We okay, so there's that. This is really interesting. I think they did a really good job with this. Oh, uh, we gotta go back down. There we go. I remember, I think, when Link Wake was on the Game Boy as a kid, Zelda's a part of my childhood. Now it's, it's nice being streamed, right? Yeah, like, and honestly, Zelda has just been such a huge staple for a lot of people getting into the gaming community itself. Like, honestly, Zelda, I think, had, Zelda had such a tremendous impact on gaming as a whole. It's like, again, like, I think uh, Ocarina of Time really helps solidify, like, what a uh, 2D to 3D game can really do, you know? And then we let go. Okay, we just made it. Um, is this, like, um... Oh, we could just get it right away. You got the dungeon map. Okay. Because, like, I didn't know if in um, this game it's similar to, like, what they did with uh, Link to the Past. Where the big key unlocks the boss's lower room and also, you know, the uh, the new item sort of thing. Slugs everywhere. Let's get rid of them. We need... Uh, what we need now is something to hold down the switch. Yo, we got a jar we can use. You just watch my own play OOT until I can actually figure it out. OOT was a great one for sure. Um, one of the things I just did not like about OOT at all was the water temple. Everything else is fine. I just did not like the water temple. It's not hard by any stretch of the means. You just have to like kind of know like where to go back and forth, you know? 
Once you take a hold of something with R, use... Yeah, I mean, we already kind of know about that. Because, like, we've been doing that with, like, some of the other statues and also the mushrooms, Elza. We, we're gaming. We're doing good, man. Uh, now... Oh, I see. Okay. Now we gotta just gotta do this. Let's go. We got a small key. Let's go. Like, I'm really excited for the Breath of the Wild 2 sequel. Like, the way that it's shaping up is gonna look really interesting. That's why the Princess Water Temple really confused me. Though. Oh, yeah. No, like, I feel like in all the Zelda games, like, the Water Temples are always some of the more difficult ones for sure. Um... Like, the one I hate the most, and it's one of the reasons why I don't play this one too often, is uh, Majora's Mask is a, uh, whatchamacallit, water temple. It's it's very, very difficult. Because, like, there's so many different things you have to keep in track of that it just makes it really difficult to focus on. Oh, wrong button. Oh, wrong weapon. Yeah, I, you, I would agree with uh, say teacher. Hydration is definitely important. Hydration is definitely important. It should be good. There we go. Let's game. Water temple can have off. Seriously, it, seriously, especially in Majora's Mask. It's like literally the most difficult one before. Like. The reason why it's super difficult, too, is because of all the water manipulation you have to do. But also, considering the fact that you have a time limit, too, just makes it so much more difficult. Plus, of course, you have to, you pretty much have to, um, do the things with, like, you know, the fairies. And it's not a lot of fun. Um. Okay, yeah, I... So we're gonna pull this back. Yeah, we're good. Okay, we got it. Forgive me while I summon my inner monologue. <laughs> Jeez. I see what you did there, Hopesius. Thank you for the goat redemption, but hopefully hopefully things, you know, like, especially with, like, you know, Grandma's table, hopefully that makes it out of it. I, I think it will, especially since you're doing a great job keeping it out of the water. But again, um, let me know what kind of ice cream you want, and we'll see about sending it out to you. Because I do need your address, too, especially for sure. I like the Fierce DD Mask in that one. Oh, yeah. No, the Fierce DD Mask definitely is amazing. Like, especially just, like, going through all the bosses and just, like, destroying them. Like, literally destroying them. It is super, super satisfying. Like, I think that's, like, one of the biggest things people take away from uh, Majora's Mask. Besides, like, how dark the game is. But, again, it's it's a really good one. Um, Seriously, super good. It's okay. No, it's great for me. I feel like I need enough sugar for these days. Okay, if you change your mind, though, hopes you just let me know. Let me know for sure. Seriously, it's so OP because he's literally, like, destroys everything and anything. Ooh, we went too far. I think that's, like, the lore that the Fierce Deity was actually, like, some kind of, like, false something like that. Be your be <laughs> Yo, Puffy, thank you for the dab, and no worries. Sounds good, Puffy. Uh, we gotta get rid of this. No, we probably had to push it there, yeah? Yeah, we had to do that. Um, no. I'm pretty sure I can... Well, actually, no, he's right. Because, like, um... If I do that, I can't really do much because, like... It blocks off the path, right? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it does. It's unfortunate we can't open from that side. I think he made Majora's from a beast. Maybe. I'm not 100% sure, like, with the lore of Majora's Mask, because even though I love the game, um, it's, like, only one I've, like, went through once. I played it on the Nintendo 64 back in the day. Um, and I know they did a remake for it, which is really cool and all, but I haven't really played the remake, to be honest with you. Like, I got up to, I think, a little bit after for the remake, but it's been a long time since I actually played my 3DS. So we can't really fight these guys. So we're gonna activate that. Okay, so that one is fine. So we are good. I do have a key. I play a drum to it. It's a comic thing I saw long ago. I'm trying to remember. If I th that sounds familiar, actually. Now that you think about it like that. 
The powered up gear uh, granted to adult like when you had all the experience. I mean, it's possible. Um, I don't know. Like, I feel like I kind of like want to go look into more of the information now. Okay, that's pretty straightforward. Let's get it. Let's get it. So we probably have to wait for him to chill out a little bit. Okay, now we're good. This kind of reminds me of like one of the Mario boss things. Some really interesting backstory on service in the manga. There's a manga for Metroid Prime? Like for Metroid? I actually did not know that was a thing. It's like I know Zelda has like a manga and stuff like that, but I didn't know Metroid actually had one. Interesting. But then again, like the only Metroid game I really played was uh, Metroid Prime and uh, Metroid 2 for like the NES or the like Game Boy or something like that. You got the Gus Jar. Hold the button to draw things and release it to fire them out. That is actually pretty interesting. Let's uh, let's bust that out really quick here, shall we? Uh, we're not gonna. We barely use a shield, so we're just gonna switch that out. All right, we're good. Oh, we might as well save too. I keep forgetting I can't use the touch screen because again, it's all for whatever, like you know, the virtual console stuff. It's worth reading for sure. I'll have to look into it for sure. Um, like right now, I only like read like uh, some like you know the more popular mangas and animes right now, like uh, Black Clover and uh, like uh, My Hero. But I'd definitely be down looking into that because it just sounds really interesting. Prime one to three are some of my favorite games of all time, but they might be taken from the nostalgia. I mean, I played Prime one. Prime one was really fun. I've uh, also uh, played a little bit of uh, Echoes, and I think I have three, but I haven't actually gotten to it yet because I didn't finish two yet. Uh, I have a couple things to think I have them in my room so the flood didn't destroy them. That is true. Um, that is true. And I'm glad to hear that not everything was destroyed, but I do imagine that was a lot. That was probably, unfortunately, not spared. Yeah, Blackfire, not Blackfire, but Black Clover has definitely been fired. Um, especially with some of the transformations and stuff going on. I'm not going to say anything, but it's amazing. Like, uh, I, I'm super happy with it. Okay, so... We gotta go down from here. See if there's anything for here. Ooh, a switch, let's go. We got 20 mysterious shells. I'm not really sure what they're for, but let's just hold on to them for now. Interesting. Um, Yeah, I have no idea what those are for. I kind of forgot what they actually do. I'm assuming they may have something similar to like the, um, what is it called? Like the, Conch shells or the shells from like a uh, Link's Awakening. Okay, so now okay, so these are they're vulnerable in this state. Okay, so that's pretty nice. I'm assuming we drop in from there, maybe. Oh, so there's a portal. Where does it? Oh, there's a treasure chest up here too. You got ten mysterious shells. Let's go. Hope CS, don't give yourself, don't discredit yourself like that. Again, it's not easy going through what you have to go through. So, it, again, don't you don't need to discredit yourself. Another one. What are these mysterious shells for? Like, what do they do? Anyway, let's uh, let's continue on. I'll just figure out about like what to do with that puzzle later, or portal, I should say. Right. All right, so that takes care of those two. Of course, there's a switch there. More mysterious shields. What the hell do these things do? I'm assuming like it has something to do with the Picori, but I'm not 100% sure. Um, I guess we're gonna go in here. Oh, we can't, but we can go through here. And also, now that we have this opened, yes, we can actually open up this one too. Can I fall through this? Yes, we can. Interesting. Yeah, we can travel by water. How are you gonna be streaming today? Uh, honestly, the stream should be over already, but I'll probably go to the end of uh, this dungeon, honestly, because we're almost done with it, I believe. So I'll probably go for like maybe another half hour or something like that. Lately, we've actually been, like I've kind of been streaming a little bit longer um, like, when we were doing Hades for the first time, I ended up streaming for, like, almost three hours. Which is insane, but Hades, like, it just makes time fly so fast. You know? It's really interesting. 
those who haven't played Hades yet, I would totally recommend Hades. Definitely blew me away with how good it was in quality. And I don't even like roguelikes, and I was really vibing to it. There we go. <laughs> come on, come on, Link. Get, get your act together. There we go. Oh, we got to move one of these things. Okay. I know everyone was super hyped about it, right? Yeah, no, everybody was super hyped about it, and apparently, like, um, oh, come on, why did I have to do that? Uh, we could still, we could still save it. Like, no, like, uh, apparently we actually did really, really good. We got to Asylum on my second run. It was insane. I should be able to sleep small. He'd be the wake will make me early. I'm assuming like a, like a kid or something like that. Um, that's what I, like, that's my interpretation, but that definitely makes sense. Uh, fortunately, the only thing I have to wake up to is just going to work, but that makes sense. How late is it for you? Hopefully it's not too late. I'm sorry if we kept you up too late. There we go. Oh, but now... Oh, come on. Toddler and a baby. Wow, that... Yeah, no, like, not even this one, but two. That isn't... That is so interesting, though. It must be really nice having them a part of the family, though. I mean, like, it's got to be pretty challenging at some point, but it's definitely got to be really rewarding, I bet. Yo, welcome back, puppy. Good to see you. Hope you're doing well. There we go. Now we got another... Uh, whatchamacallit? Key. There we go. Lost it. <laughs> Welcome back, puppy. Alright, so. Uh, we need the charger thing. That's one of the things I'm not a huge fan of. Uh, Saiyan teacher, if you're still in here. Is the uh, power for the Wii U thing doesn't last too long. It really doesn't. Alright, so. Map. So we're on here. I do not have... Okay, so we're actually on the floor I need to be on. Right? Yeah, yeah, we are. Okay. So let's go here. No, we actually need to go to the bottom floor. Do I have a way to get to the bottom floor from here? The barrel, maybe. Maybe the barrel. Yeah, I think the barrel might be the way to do it. Maybe? Is there any more? Hmm. No. But. That is going to be my best bet to getting to the bottom floor. So we're just going to drop down again. Okay. So we got to go up. I didn't go all the way. That's my fault. That is my fault. So I think I had to go around a little bit more. I'm glad to have them joining our gaming family as they grow. There you go. That is one way to look at it too. Like, and then the, like the way that I see it, like, I feel like introducing them to the classics and then like slowly, go, like having them see like you know some of the more like yeah, current things would be the way to go. Because like honestly, like if we didn't have Super Mario 64 and all that good stuff, we wouldn't have like some of the really good stuff. That's a great way to look at it. I love it. I love it. <laughs> I, I just meant to grab this. Um, I can't fling myself far enough, so we gotta go this way. Uh, we should be good now. Um, How do we go? Oh, wait. I have an idea. <laughs> We're gaming. Let's go. Like this, uh, this, this, uh, wind jar is actually really useful. Like, really, really useful. And there we go, we stuck the landing. So now we got the big key. So now we are gaming here. Interesting, a red portal. And there's a blue portal also in the game. Ooh, I like it. Let's get it. Again, Hopesius, if you do need anything, don't hesitate to reach out to myself. And of course, like, you know, I'm not sure if you told mom about it either, but she could, she probably should know as well to see if there might be anything she could do as well. Um, so let's go to the first floor here. I'm assuming this will, yeah, it'll take us straight to the boss fight. Let's get it. Oh, we gotta get, can I grab this? I mean, I 
could if I go the other way. So I'm going to grab it really quick. Most of my family games, so it's inevitable. I mean, there you go. Like, um, I'm assuming it might be like some of the classics, right? Like maybe like, um, like Wii Sports, I feel like is like one of the best family games out there. Mario Party, stuff like that. Like, honestly, I kind of wish I had a copy of Mario Party. Uh, not Mario Party, but uh, Wii Sports. Not even kidding. 20 rupees still isn't too bad. I'll actually take it. That's actually fine. Um, because honestly, having money early on is never a bad thing. So I think what we'll do is we'll finish off this dungeon and then finish off the final boss and then we'll be good. Shouldn't take too long with these like first level dungeon bosses. All right, let's go. Oof, not enough, not enough. All right. So rule number one in any Zelda game: when you get a dun when you get an item in a dungeon, you're gonna use that item for the dungeon. It's like oh, it's like an uns it's like always a pretty much a big spoken rule. Oh, interesting. So we actually have to fight one of the normal enemies, but huge, like one of the big, like a big version of it. Nintendo and Xbox, great. Honestly, Nintendo has some really good stuff. Same thing with Xbox. Honestly, they're all really good. Lately, these days, I've been gearing more towards like Nintendo and PlayStation, but Xbox is still a pretty strong contender. Yo, morning, Jester. Good to see you. Hope you are doing well. How's it going, my dude? So I'm assuming um, we do this. Oh. I mean, it looks like we're doing something right because he's losing, like it's reacting to it, right? You know? Oh, it's making it lopsided. So do we attack now? Oh, he just falls. <laughs> this probably doesn't sound good. I'm sorry, but that's actually kind of funny to me. But how are you doing, Jester? Welcome to the stream, my dude. We're actually getting close to the end here. I'm doing good. I appreciate for asking. I mean, we are going through a ridiculous heat. I think we kind of talked about the heat wave earlier, but yeah, it's uh, still going pretty strong, my dude. Watch out. Oh, man. Give me the rest. All right, there we go. So good. I'm actually pretty tempted to look up at like uh, Kijia Fune to see if he worked on the other games too, like uh, Oracle of Ages and Seasons. Come on, jump, dude. There you go. <sighs> Wrong way. Sea of Thieves is because we figured out how to take over the sub uh, server sometimes. I've heard Sea of Thieves is really fun. I actually do have it, but I haven't actually taken the time to play it yet. Um, but it looks really, I think it also does cross platform these days, right? This thing is not giving up. And I, I respect that, I respect that. Oof. I think we're done, I think we're done with the fight. Let's go. We did it. We did it. That must be the earth element, right? We need to get four to remake the Picori blade. You got the Earth Element. The power of the Earth is the source of all living things. The Earth Element is the embodiment of that power. I like it. I can dig with it. Oh, wrong button again. Interesting. So there's another portal to, like, leave? Hmm. PC annihilates the Xbox players so we don't cross-plat. I mean, that's fair, just because I'm assuming, like, the PC version is just, like, more optimized or something like that. We enjoy the Minish Cap. Minish Cap is going great so far. I don't see why I wouldn't, Lady Allen. Honestly, like, this game is really good so far. Hey, Mel, how's it hanging? Yo, Kiritipu, welcome to the stream. Good to see you. We're actually just about to wrap it up, and I'm doing good. Hope you are doing well. Oh, we've got the Elder. You just go tell the Elder at once. Yeah, we'll go tell the, we'll go tell the Elder really quick, too. Because then after that, we can just, like, you know, yeet ourselves back to reality. Uh, So we're in the Minish Village, I believe... Actually, I don't even remember where the other is. That's where we got the, the the like the special way to translate their language. Um, no, this doesn't look familiar. So this can't be it. I don't think it's this way either. No, that possibly can't get it. 
We lack so bad, but it's impossible to battle close quarters. Interesting. Um, interesting. But I mean, still, I mean, it's still a good game though, right? Wait, do we actually have to talk to this guy again? Is that what we're supposed to do? You retrieve the earth element from the fiend infested shrine? Incredible, I guess we do. All right, I can vibe with that. Humans are amazing creatures. The other is sure to be amazed too. Oh wait, that's not the other. That's the the shrine, dude. Okay. Um, how was Hades? Hades was amazing, honestly. Like, I'm not a huge roguelike fan, Kiritabu, but Hades was something special, just like this piece of heart. Let's go. Um, we actually got pretty. I think I actually got pretty far in like my third run or second run. Um, yeah, but Hades is great. So far, my preferred weapon is the bow. And uh, I can't wait to play more of Hades. It'll probably be the thing we're going to be streaming a lot on Tuesdays. Um, where is the leader? It's not here. No, no, no. That's just some dude's house. I don't think I have a map for the Picori village, do we? Nah, some dude again. Can I zoom in? I mean, kind of. Hmm, that's fine. I'll do a little bit of exploring before we just eat anyway. Nothing right there, that's weird. It's fun, best play with friends and family. Oh yeah, absolutely, especially like when you can get like Discord calls involved and stuff like that. I could definitely see it like being a really fun experience. I feel like a lot of games are really strong in that regard too. Like, um, especially with, like with It Takes Two was definitely a good example of that. Glad you like to start my playthrough of Xenoblade and oh my god, I can already tell I'm addicted. That is awesome. Um, I tried playing Xenoblade Chronicles 2. I don't know, like, I maybe I just need to give it another shot, but I just really couldn't get too much invested into it. Like, I think like the auto attack thing kind of threw me off because I wasn't used to that. Um, but I'll probably give it another chance. Like when I get through, like, you know, some other games first and I'll try playing again. Are you going to get anything in the Steam Summer Sale? Honestly, um, I haven't taken too much of a look there, Juster. But if I were to get anything right now, I would probably choose something like... Um, like, again, I really do like um, anime in My Hero Academia. There was a My Hero Academia Once Justice 2 for like 15 bucks. I'm kind of tempted about picking up that, but aside from that, not much is on my mind. What about you, dude? Uh, I'm trying to avoid buying any more games to avoid filling my backlog even more. Um, I can't find the Elder. I'm just rolling around the same location. So I think we're just going to cap off the stream here. Get it? Cap? Minish cap? Community is how some games survive. Exactly. Exactly. Uh, I feel like Among Us is a great example of that, too. And it's such a fun, easy game to stream with, like, you know, on Twitch. Because you can have, like, you know, the viewers jump in. Especially now with the update of, like, 15 people. That is really cool. Um, yeah, I can't find the other today. I don't know why. We found him like the first one with no problem. We just keep ending it like getting right there. Only game I played was Xenoblade X when I told my friend he was highly offended. I never complained because I had no idea what I was doing, but then going through with Xenoblade is going through great. I've heard great things about Xenoblade X for the Wii U 2. I might have to dip into it as well. I know it's a little bit different from the other ones. Um, because like, I think it's like mech based, but I'm definitely like looking to playing it as well. Sounds like an extensive backlog catalog. <laughs> oh, the Lady Allen, you have no idea. You have no idea. Like my backlog is ever, never ending. It's, it's quite frightening actually at this point. Um, I sometimes don't like to think about it because I'm like, it's going to be forever. It's going to be forever, you know, but it's all good. I like collecting too. So it kind of has like a double edged sword, but let's do a quick save and see if anybody's streaming right now. And be able to have a raid to them. <clears throat> well, we'll, we'll so I promise we will find the other at some point. Looks like we got Ramen who's still streaming. That is pretty dope. Looks like they're doing Mafia too. So if anybody wants to join, we can definitely give Ramen a raid here. Assuming he's uh, not ending the stream like right away too. I'm down with that. Let's give let's show Ramen two four two some love. Really cool streamer. Really cool dude. Honestly. <clears throat> Yo, I don't see a stream is ending. I think we're good. Let's go. But everybody, thank you so much for joining in for the Wind Waker stream. We had a lot of fun. I'm glad we finished that off and start off with uh, Minish Cap. I'm can already tell this is actually looking out to be a really good game. I will tell you one thing. Story for Xenoblade 
is a hundred times better for the animation art style. Xenoblade X is absolutely beautiful. I've heard it was one of the best looking Twitch, uh, not sorry, Twitch games, but Wii U games. And honestly, I definitely need to play it at some point. It'll just take me a while. Have a good night, Kiritapu. Have a good night, Jester. It's great to see you all again. I'll have to have time to get into game more in a week. Finally, there you go, Lady Ellen. Hopefully you can get a lot of good gaming in these times. Because again, especially with like, you know, the summer Steam back sale, like summer Steam sale, a lot of great additions you can add to your backlogs. Fortunately for me though, I'm trying to revert from that. But everybody, thank you so much for dropping in. I appreciate you. As a reminder, we do have a Discord. If you do want to be a part of it, if you're not already a part of it, to get notifications when I do go live here on Twitch. Everybody have a great night. I appreciate you. And uh, let's uh, raid the good ramen 242.